Welcome back, everybody. It's the Halloween edition of CTV Morning Live, and I'm joined by the Hypnotizers. As a matter of fact, the CEO of the Hypnotizers is Kenda Summers. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. Good to have you here. Thank Michael you. Andrews is the known as the world's fastest hypnotizer. How are you, Michael? Fine, thank you. How are thanks, you? Thanks for coming all the way up from Maryland. Right? You drove up from Maryland? To escape the snow. No doubt. <laughs> <laughs> what is the hypnotizers all about, Kenda? The hypnotizers, we are stage hypnotists. So what we do is we have fun with people. Uh -huh. We put them into um, crazy situations where uh -huh. they perform for people. Now, do you have shows or, yeah, we, or we gatherings? Shows. What do you do? Yeah, we have shows all around North America. We do fairs. We do um, corporate gigs. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. And you're a hypnotist yeah. yourself? Yeah, we're both clinical hypnotists really? first. And, and when they say clinical hypnotist, Michael, what, what does that mean? Well, we help people with their ordinary problems like weight loss and smoking cessation. We can also cure phobias and, and just make them better. You know, it, they can make some really powerful changes in their lives using hypnosis. Right, right. So what kind of suggestions do you make to people then uh, that, are, that are useful other than show suggestions, you know? Uh, well, when I work with weight loss, I tell people they'll work on four things. They'll drink plenty of water, they'll exercise, they'll make the right food choices, uh -huh. and they'll control their portions. And when you do those four things, you lose weight. Right. So those, that's one set of suggestions I use. Right. And it's, it's, is this a repeated procedure? Like, does this go on over several visits? or? With weight loss, it does go over several yeah. visits because I can't cut them off like smoking. They still have to con continue to eat. Right, right. So there's different uh, sorts of hypnosis when it comes out. There's, uh, there's hypnosis for, for things like that. And then there's a show. Entertainment. Entertainment yeah. purposes, yeah, right? Exactly. Right, but it, does yeah. it work both ways, Kenda? Is that? Oh, oh, definitely, definitely. Yeah. But the best people for a show, Kurt, are going to be the ones that are crazy. They're going to be the, the ones with a lampshade on their head at a party. Right. Those are going to be. <laughs> I've seen those shows. Exactly. Matter of fact, when I was a youngster, my dad was hypnotized by Ravine, oh, okay. which was really cool. Yeah. The man they call Ravine. Awesome. Right? And it was fun to watch yeah, my father for sure. doing that. Yeah. He still not stopped doing it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you, you had. Uh, uh, some volunteers, right? Some people that um, you talked to earlier on? Right, and one of the things that Kenda and I do, if, if uh, some people would like to come up and be hypnotized, one of the things we do are instant inductions. Right. And the beauty of that is there's no chance of collateral damage. Yeah. It is impossible for someone in the viewing audience to go into trance. Yeah, is it true that there are some people who just can't be hypnotized or it doesn't work or the suggestions don't, don't work on them? It's a very small fraction of the people that really? can be hypnotized. Anyone can do it. No kidding. Yes. All right, well, All right. go. go to work and let's see what happens here. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have one gentleman. Are you guys all ready to be hypnotized? I need nods of your head if you're all ready to be hypnotized. Um, cross your legs, put your hands on your thighs, and focus your attention directly and only on us. Right. And we're right. getting to my eyes. Give me your hand. Give me my eyes. Sleep. Even deeper, 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 deeper down. down. Look, look at me. Give me your hand. Look at me. Sleep. Even deeper. That's right. Drifting down. That's right. Eve. Look at me. Give me your hand. Look at me. Sleep. Even deeper. Good. Deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you you go. You'll hear sounds. Nothing will bother you. You'll listen to our voices. Any sound you hear just helps you to go deeper into hypnosis. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Sean and I have put your favorite musical instrument in front of you. You've got your favorite musical instrument in front of you. On the count of three, I need you guys to sit up straight in your seat, eyes remaining closed. I need you to pick up that instrument and play like you guys are in an orchestra for this live studio audience in front of you. One, two, three, pick up Mike that Q, instrument and song play, number one. play, play, play. One million dollars, guys. This is for one million dollars. These audience members are going to be waiting, you guys, to see who plays the best. One million dollars. You guys at the audience, let's give these guys a round of applause. Encourage them. Nicely done. Nice. <laughs> we got a rope back there. And. <laughs> Jump Cut the music, the please, Sick. Mike. All right, now, ladies and gentlemen, these people are not only wonderful musicians, they're absolutely fantastic dancers. They live to dance. They love to dance. In a moment, Mike is going to cue song number two, and at that point, these people are going to stand up and give you their best dance. Mike, if you please cue the song. Up out of your chairs, eyes That's closed. Right. Mike, please stop the music. 
Excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. What, what are you doing? Dancing. Dancing. Um, we're trying to do a very serious <laughs> hypnosis show right here. Serious comedy hypnosis show. Would you please sit down in your seat? That's right, everyone, please sit down. Please sit down, go deeper. Relax, go deeper, relax. I don't All know right. about this, Kanda. I don't I know, don't know either. The person I'm touching now, sleep. The person I'm touching now, anytime you hear the word spooky, you're going to jump out of your chair. You're going to walk around the studio here in a zombie like state. If you understand what I'm saying, I want you to nod your head. Excellent. All right, the person I'm touching right now, whenever you hear the term trick or treat, you will take this bag that I'm putting in your lap right now, you will go out into the audience and you will trick or treat because you want some candy. If you understand that, <laughs> nod your head. Good. The person I'm touching right now, you are our fitness fanatic. Anytime you hear the word fitness, you are going to jump up to the front of the stage. You're going to give everybody your One, two, best three, jumping jobs. The person I'm touching now, only the person I'm touching now, if you understand what I'm saying, nod your One, head. Two, three, back to your seat. Slide away. Go back to your seat. And the person that I am touching right now, Whenever you hear the term Halloween night, you will sing our favorite Halloween song, which is trick or treat, smell my feet, give me something, something good, good to eat. If you understand that, nod your head. Good. All right. All righty. You know what? As I look around this audience, members, there are a lot of spooky costumes out there. There are a lot of spooky well, costumes out there. There are a lot of there. spooky costumes, but spooky costumes are what you want when you're out there trick or treating. The one thing that you got to remember, though, is you got to remember your fitness goals. Your fitness goals are very important well, when you're trick or treating. Fitness is great, but on Halloween night, on oh, Halloween night. Oh, oh my gosh. Just cue the music. Cue Mike. the music. <laughs> <laughs> cue song number two, Mike. <laughs> Let's give these guys a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. These guys are absolutely fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, thanks to our audience members who participated. Now, Kenda, tell me, what happens next to, the, to these people? Obviously, they're still, uh, they're they're, still under the yeah, influence, they're right? they're in hypnosis still. So what we'll do, we'll emerge them, and um, we can give them some fun suggestions so people can have fun with them after the show. I like that whole idea. Yeah. If you could make one or two suggestions that we could do during the show for the last half hour, that would sure. be fun, too. Sure, sure. Thanks so much for coming and Thank you very us. much for having me. Where do we find out more it. about uh, uh, www.thehypnotizers.ca. Thehypnotizers.ca. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for having Pleasure. us. Thanks. Thank you. I appreciate it.